That's like our own little mini Patricia Nash Skype today special, if you ask me. <laughs> Did you have a chance to see that, uh, Patricia? The cross Absolutely. Body. It's nine, one of my nine. favorites. I can't get over that. I, I truly, I'm so excited. Well, as we said, we have a wonderful mix in these next couple of hours of wonderful styles that are true and tried and always a favorite. And we have our classic. Boy, you talk about the workmanship of this leather. Almost, I can you almost like feel the carving of the artist uh -huh. come yeah. to life in this beautiful tote. It's just it, exceptional. Thank you, thank you. This is really, really thick leather. It's like a 2.2 or something mm leather. And it has to be really thick to take debossing. You know, you have embossing and you have debossing. Sometimes I do but, uh, a combination of both, but see how thick that definition is of those flowers? It's just amazing. It's just amazing. Oh my goodness. And, and what else is amazing is this wonderful sale price. I just kind of glanced yes. up. My producer <laughs> was mentioning something to me. This is almost $40 off uh, a customer pick favorite. So if you have a moment, uh, go online, read those reviews. So let's talk about these colors. Okay. Y yes. Uh, I'm yes. showing teal on this, but is that not right? Is that, let me, oh, it is teal. Okay. I was just checking with my producer. Teal, black, and they're calling the what we normally call tan. I don't know why gold, but it really is. A, it's okay. Today it's calling gold, but I, I, I'm not sure why. But it is tan. <laughs> but gold when you're ordering, and that's your your signature classic luggage color. Yes, and, and it just looks gorgeous. And you know, this has got a crossbody strap, and I'm sure we're going to go through all the detailing. Yes, yes. But just beautiful workmanship. And I'm going to go inside here, too, because this one is a little bit on a smaller scale than the other two that we started with. But wait till you see when I say small, but grandiose of what you can actually put in there. So Tiana is showing off the, the actual strap because the strap is fully adjustable, all leather, 18 to 20 inches. So you can easily detach that if you choose to do so or perfect to be able to you know, instantly turn into a shoulder bag or a crossbody, either or. Um, and... The inside, and that's where it's pretty exciting because this is the one, it's like a little surprise because you have a full zipper and then when you open, you actually have two side snap pockets. Only yeah, you just like that. an accordion, right? You just yes. open it up and there you go. You don't even have to open the main compartment of your bag to get out what you might use frequently. How nice is that? And I also love, I, I know we, we didn't even touch upon it, but the signature lining that you put in all of your bags, which makes everything so easy to find. It's not a black hole and it feels mm -hmm. like the most expensive, beautiful suede. It is. It's a beautiful, you know, I don't know why, but all the vintage bags that I collected over the years that are 40, 50, 60 years old, they all have this lining in it. I so I don't know why, but I, I know it really works for us. We get so many compliments about that. Like you said, the color, the hand feel, the fact you can put your glasses or different things in there and they don't get scratched up. Uh, so it's just a it's a, just a really beautiful, good difference of, of other bags that are out there. And everything about it, even your signature card on the inside, so you know it's a real Patricia Nash. You have something, you know, of the finest quality, beautiful, beautiful workmanship. I'm showing you how easily this one also opens uh, when possible. You know, again, you always do these wonderful, wonderful zippers that do not get, you know, caught. They don't knot, they're strong, yeah. they're industrial. They're Here's all that embossed tooling. And like I said, this floral deboss on this particular bag is really super special because it has to be really thick leather to take that deep uh, emboss on there. And you can see how it just has all the highs and lows. It literally burned that leather to give it that dark color like that you see in this, in this picture. And you couldn't do that with... Uh, a cheap leather because mm -hmm. if you did it would just burn it i mean it would burn it like melt it like and because this is all vegetable tan leather and doesn't have plastic chemicals and things like that in the leather or on top of the leather it truly embosses it as if it was tooled 
Isn't She's that amazing? Gorgeous. I can even kind of show that, uh, Patricia, from the from the front, or if I turn it in to the camera here, how thick, like you were saying. Yes. That and look at that. That's all hand cut. Imagine sewing those two pieces of leather together, like the trim on the inside of the bag and the panel on the outside of the bag, and on a single stitch machine. Unreal. And then hand burning all of those edges to get all the frayed leather off, but still exposing that beautiful leather. You know, there's a lot of brands out there that take leather and then they fold it under it and then they put a faux leather next to it so that the inside collar here is not the same quality of the leather on the outside and they turn it in. So I think that's one of the reasons I really embrace this craftsmanship, that this how they did it long ago, because you see the rawness of it. Mm. You see the natural beauty and the quality of the leather. Look at that embossing. You know, I don't I don't get a chance to be on this side of the screen <laughs> looking at the bags on TV. And I mean, I'm like, oh my gosh, that's beautiful. I honestly, because I'm usually behind standing by you, right, Liz? Right, exactly. I get, I'm sure it gives you a whole different oh, perspective. Oh, I mean, honestly, I just got like, like goosebumps because oh. it is so beautiful. Um, it, this is just one of a kind. If you haven't ha bought a Patricia Nash bag, I really encourage you to. I think you'll appreciate it. Um, people will always notice and say, oh my gosh, where'd you get your bag? You're gonna feel good about it and you're gonna have it for absolutely years. I couldn't agree with you more. And what, you know, we often talk about lost art and art, lost artwork. This extreme dimension, like you were talking